the whole thing wobbing. Golden tickets released yesterday. We knew there was something off that EA fixed about them, but I think there's something else that happened. Now, I do want to give a shout out to Big G for being a part of the Nota Gang. If you guys want a chance to shout out the next video, drop a like in the vid. Make sure you guys are sub to the channel. Turn notification bell on and comment down below. Nota Gang. Also, if you guys have not already checked out Underdog Fantasy, you can sign up right now using code ZARK to double your first deposit up to $100. New users get a .5 special. And if you guys especially are in Florida, you are missing out right now. I've been getting a special almost every single day to celebrate Champions Mode coming to Florida. So you guys are really missing out if you're in Florida and not on Underdog with code Zerk, of course. And again, yesterday, another day of profit off the NBA. It wasn't a spectacular day, but again, another profit day of NBA. Today, there's only one game, but it's actually a really good one. Let's see how we do today. All right, so we need to talk about this because, again, if we don't talk about stuff like this and we don't kind of address it, then it's not possible that something's going to happen. So, number one, Golden Tickets. They released yesterday around 1.30 p.m. Eastern Time. When they released, there was a lot of weird stuff going on with them. Number one, you could come over to the catalog and there was a filter for Golden Tickets, but they weren't in the catalog, okay? Number two, when these cards actually got released, they were not as good as they are now. I actually did a gameplay already with Brees Hall and Vincent Jackson over on Xerxes 2. You guys are going to check it out. Cards were great. Honestly, they were really, really great cards. Uh, really, really fun cards. Brees Hall and Vincent Jackson, both really fun. But there was something that actually changed after I did the gameplay that EA updated, which is making all of these X factors right here similar to AKA, where they take three plays to charge up, they're active for six, they go away for three, they come back. Same thing with uh, Julius Peppers as well with his abilities. We got angry runs added on to Brees Hall, all that. So we already know that when these cards came out, okay, they weren't in the catalog, then they weren't in the catalog, they didn't have the correct abilities. They got the updated X factors, but... There is something else that I did talk to you guys about. And if you follow me over on Twitter, I get tweeted a lot, okay? Obviously, with Zerk Luck tweets of people opening up packs. Here's the thing, though. You guys see that special offer right there? The current released golden bundle, whatever, the uh, golden ticket special offer that I did already open up. For the first, I'd say about seven hours, okay? And I got hundreds of tweets of packs. The only golden ticket polls that I personally saw, guys, we're from that pack right there. I did not receive a single tweet of anybody pulling a golden ticket from a normal pack. Now, that's not normal. Golden tickets are always in normal packs as well. Now, again, I understand that golden tickets are not going to have the best pack odds like every single year. They're not going to have the best pack odds. But I did not get my first tweet of a golden ticket poll until 8.45 p.m. Eastern Time last night. Someone DM'd me. Then, 10 minutes later, someone tweeted me this with them pulling Julius Peppers here from a Pro Max Fantasy Pack. Now, again, as I said... I know golden tickets are going to be rare to packs, guys, but I get literally hundreds of tweets of packs. When content drops at 1.30 and there's limiteds in packs, I am not kidding when I can tell you that I get over 100 tweets within that first hour of limited time polls. This is not normal. I'm telling you right now, golden tickets were not in the normal packs from 1.30 to probably anywhere around 8.30 p.m. Eastern time. I am almost certain they were not in packs. With that being said, guys, like I said, I am almost certain that they were not in normal packs until 8.30 p.m. Eastern time at, like, the earliest. Like I said, first DM I got was at 8.45, and after that, 8.55. So, uh, I know they're rare, like I said, but they definitely weren't in there. So, the next step here is, number one, I'm making a video about this, right? Number two would be for us to go ahead and tell EA about this issue. Now, I've already tweeted at EA last night. I'm going to go ahead and tweet at EA again today. But when they put out like content reveals and everything, we kind of need to be reminding them about this. And I will tell you this, there are always issues with the very first golden ticket release, like every single year. There's always issues with it. It's like guaranteed to happen. And I believe that they straight up just were not in the pack. So in my opinion, I do believe we are due some make rights. What make rights could it possibly be? Well, that would be up to EA, right? But if it were up to me as the 95 overall Jair Alexander, okay, we'll take that right there. Uh, I would assume that it would hopefully be any packs that we opened up here between like 1.30 to whatever the time period is that they determine that golden tickets were not in packs here. Again, that's just kind of a uh, 
rough example of what it could potentially be not saying 100 that it will be that but yeah i think we are definitely due there with that being said let's go ahead and open up some mystery packs here and let's see if we can actually pull one of these golden tickets now they are actually available here now i'm not sure if you guys are watching this video here in the morning or if you're watching it in the afternoon of wednesday you're seeing it one of the two time slots here either in the morning or the afternoon uh but tonight we might have a little bit of a reel we do have infinite flux part two which is going to be dropping tomorrow uh tomorrow morning we'll have an ea stream where they're going to go over all the reveals and everybody might have like one or two players potentially revealed tonight so be on the lookout i might have another video for you guys tonight going over uh the infinite flux reveals there if not I would definitely have a video for you guys in the morning going over all of that content. We also do have another release of golden tickets that's going to be dropping this week. Issue is, we don't know what day because EA, for some reason, refuses to put dates in the content schedule. But we don't know if that's going to be tomorrow with Infinite Flux, if that's going to be Friday. Like, which in my opinion, honestly, I would hope that it's Friday just simply to kind of spread out the content there. I actually would not mind if it was on Friday. There could also be Saturday with Ultimate Legends. But if they want to keep it going, in my opinion, the way that they should do it, up to EA, we'll see what they do. But having Golden Tickets and Packs on Tuesday, and then on Wednesday, and then, you know, with Thursday, we'll have, like, some sort of promo coming in. Friday could be another release of Golden Tickets, and then Saturday Ultimate Legends will be a nice way to kind of spread out the content throughout the week. But, hey, we will, uh... We will find out. We also don't know what other GTs they're going to be, but I will tell you guys this. I don't think they're going to be player created just yet because as I told you, the golden ticket form actually just went out to people a couple of days ago. I believe the golden tickets that will be dropping this upcoming whatever day of this week uh thursday or friday whatever it is gonna be is gonna 95 right there i believe those are as well going to be golden tickets that were created by nfl players more likely or ea devs again because there just wasn't enough time for people to go ahead and submit their uh golden ticket forms and on top of that i know somebody out there that had a golden ticket they actually wanted to do a strong safety julius peppers and then we got peppers so like they have to change what they wanted to do there's just no way these ones coming out uh whatever day this week are going to be the creative one so hopefully um hopefully it makes them a little bit better than this first batch i will say i do think that the Brees hall is really really good especially with the angry runs all of that and uh on top of that the peppers a little bit disappointing but you know with the x factor he got a, a little bit better you could still pick him up as a user card that's for sure but his ability is definitely could have been way way better vincent jackson i like the card i think that card is an absolute tank absolute monster of a card uh and then when it comes to the darrington evans also a pretty good running back i would take Brees all over him just because he is a little bit bigger uh but let's go ahead we'll end this off here we'll do one more ring of honor we get 291s and 85 let me do like Two more mystery packs, okay? Two more mystery packs. We'll see if we can get lucky, pour ourselves like a Pro Max. I would like to get a, a Pro Max, honestly. That's probably like our best odds. Okay, 98 Terry Bradshaw. We'll do one or two final mystery packs right there, though. We got the 98 Terry Bradshaw, so hey, we'll see if we can maybe get another 98. We get a 95. Okay, packs are, packs are kind of heating up right here. We get a 98. We get a 95 overall. Pro Max Fantasy. Real deal again. Why do they keep giving me the real deals packs though like I'm, I'm not gonna pull a golden ticket more than likely out of a real deal so i would much rather get like a playmaker pack or a pro max fantasy pack real what is going on i'm getting nothing but real deals packs here we get 289s and 87 final mystery pack of the video but with that being said guys hopefully you did enjoy the video and if you did make sure to drop a like video and of course that sub button down below why do i keep getting real deals packs what is going on here is there like a glitch or something going on here thought i'll bring this to you guys attention though as you know i always try to keep you guys updated on everything going on and uh apparently if you open mystery packs today you're gonna get a million and a half real deals packs i'm just gonna do one more just to see i think i pulled like seven real deals packs in a row all right ea they said all right you're done with the real deals here's a get a gold and uh enjoy your 76 if you guys enjoyed this video check out these